The Mementos of the English Martyrs and Confessors for Every Day of the Year by Henry Sebastian Bowden. February 6, the Suna Mitis Award. Margaret Powell, 1642. Of good birth, she was reduced to great poverty through her sufferings for the faith. Her chief devotion was ministering to the priest in prison, and, though her husband was a Protestant, she generally managed to maintain one in her house. It was under her roof in the city of London that Father Bollocker was seized while saying Mass, and Margaret and her boy, aged 12, who was serving the Mass, were taken with him. At her trial in October 1642, being threatened with death for her religion, she expressed her joy at the prospect of laying down her life for the faith in which she had been born, and which she hoped with God's mercy to bear unspotted to the grave. When the judge, who was a Puritan, urged her to think of her soul and her family and embrace the national religion, instead of dying for papistical superstition, she replied that Parliament must first choose what that religion was to be. For at present, it was a matter of dispute. She was sent back to prison, and there, on hearing that Father Bollocker was condemned to death, but that her sentence was deferred, she burst into tears. Yet quickly recovering herself, she offered her new lease of life to God as obediently as she had accepted death. 